I just got a text from his sister because Which, we're all having a get together over there. Which one? Tonight from Alexis. And she said, Michael wants to know if you can bring your baseball gloves tonight to play catch with him. Oh, Paul, that one makes me cry. <laughs> I'm a very blessed man. Hey, welcome back to our stupid Rex of Corbin. I'm Rick. You can follow us on Instagram, Twitter for more juicy content. Thank you for your support on Patreon. Follow the account, subscribe, like button. Yeah. I, I, I am I am so blessed to have a son who, one, still wants to have a catch with his dad. He sent. He told me that the other day. He sent me a message and he said, we need to go to the park and have a catch. And he called me from a park. He said, we need to come to the park and have a catch. Last year, he bought tickets to take me to a Dodger Yankee game. Um, the frequently we could be walking somewhere and he'll just take my hand and we'll be holding pinkies while we walk. And when we sit on the couch, well, not so much now that he has Sam, <laughs> but he used to cuddle with me a lot. He'd wrap his legs around me and cuddle up. Now he's got Sam. Who's Sam? Sam's his girlfriend. Oh, nice. Yeah. Uh, anyway, it's today we got a video. This is the evolution of Tamil cinema. It's the actually, evolution. And this is actually just a brief uh, overview of of like the plot, the 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 big points in right. Dhamma. Well, what most people don't know is that Tamil cinema began as a single cell organism in the ocean. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, how much of these do you think will be Kamal Hassan led? He won't be included at all. He's okay. had he's had zero impact on Tamil cinema. Tamil cinema. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. That's bold. Yeah. That's a bold statement. But uh, let's see if it pays off. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> I'd like to see it. I wonder if you could still watch that. You could watch the first ever talkie. Yeah, those seem like important things to watch. You know? We've seen that. Yes, we have. First film. We've seen that song. Not the film. What is this? There's Kamal. Song first. Oh, that makes sense why the. Uh... Vikram! Oh, it's getting bigger. Can you name this song and the composer? Uh, Beethoven. I'm so proud of it's you. It's an easy one, Rick. Pluralise. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it's used it. For the first time. Kamal's in quite a few of these. He's going to be the single biggest. Especially with the technology. Yeah, the being single used. biggest influencer of Tamil cinema in the history of Tamil cinema. And I don't think there'll ever be another person of close to him. Uh, as far as the technical. This is the first film to use Dolmi Surround. Come all. <laughs> when it's it comes to the technical advancements. Yeah. Again, come all. That's pretty late to be used for the animation for the first time. <laughs> Come on. Digital camera for the first for the first time. Danush. Wow. Okay. Didn't know that. Performance capture where? For what? Obviously, I guess we have to see it. First thing you have to utilize is 3D sensor. That's uh, come on again. Oh, oh, that was short. Wow, I thought okay. Feels like that was very brief. Very brief, but very it was basically brief. a Kamal Hassan highlight film. Do you think he um, is the most influential person in Tamil cinema ever? 
That's a bold I, statement. I genuinely so, do. I was joking, obviously, at the beginning. I do. Obviously, we are so ignorant to the totality of the industry. But based on what I've seen when it comes to the technological aspects. He's a unicorn. He's And acting, of course. He's a, he's a unicorn. He does everything. He writes, he sings, he composes, he edits, he he directs, he produces, he's he I'm acts. More, I'm more talking about how much he's changed it. Yeah. So the two that I could think of, if we're just going actors, would be him and Superstar. As far in as an actor of, is concerned. Yeah. Yes. He's uh, definitely in the, in the, the conversation the with Roger. The I would McCall. include would be Money. Mm -hmm. Money Rotnam, of course. Of course. If you're including composers, Raja Sir and Raja and Aramon. And Aramon. So I, I would assume. No, most... when it comes to composing, Kamal Hassan is not beyond Raja Sir and yeah. Aramon. That's we're talking about true. filmmaking. Thinking about the totality of filmmaking and the person who's had the single greatest influence to create change. Not just Tamil cinema. And evolve all, you know, all, all India. I, I can't imagine it isn't Kamal Hassan. I'm just trying to think of. The people in Tamil cinema. I mean, there's others that have been popular and others that have done groundbreaking things. But when you're talking about Tamil cinema's evolution from its first days to today and the things that made it advance in all aspects of the art form, could there be a more influential person than Kamal yeah, Hassan? There's, this is why, like, <laughs> if we ever get to do like a podcast kind of style thing. It's just a lot of editing. There's something that I actually, <laughs> if we ever do it, I, 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 I'd want to buy. It's the software that anytime I can change whatever camera. When I'll, the person when talks. When the person talks. Yeah. And so I don't have to edit it later. And if two people are talking, it goes to both people simultaneous. Yeah. So yeah. There's, there's something that you yeah. can buy that you can yeah. do that. You don't have to edit it later. And I'm like, that's so much easier. It makes me so much more want to do it. Joe Rogan could send us some. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Um, but because like, I would love to just have whether yeah. it's a famous Tamil person, yeah, or just a a, a, a stupid baby, I'd love to just be like this is the stuff I would like to talk about. Be right, like, being somebody who knows more than we do, growing up with it, do you agree that Kamal Hassan, let's say, would be the most influential person in Tamil cinema right. history? And you can do that with any industry, any industry. Um, but Tamil specific, since it's Tamil specific, the three that I would include. Probably if you're not including Raja Sir and 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 A. R. Rahman because they're just composers, uh, would be Kamal, superstar just because of what he's done for the industry as a whole, and I know he's done advancements and stuff like that, and then probably Mani. Whether the, that's the order, I don't know. Mani might be ahead. Yeah, but why uh, wouldn't you include Raja Sir and and A. R. Rahman? Because for example, Mani is just director. He's only here wearing the one hat. But the director controls a lot of the. True, but as far as filmmaking. as far as influence on Tamil film, so it's, it's hard to off of my stupid brain that's only seen what is forty to sixty Tamil yeah, films exactly. that we've seen. Obviously, those would be my five. Me too. Uh, I, don't, in terms I think of who is the most influential Tamil but in Tamil cinema history. There, like any industry, there's going to be people we we've, we've probably not even heard of yet. Yeah, and they'll say you don't know them, but this person you wouldn't have this without them. Yeah. Um, there's a whole slew of folks that it's like you, you guys. I'll give you an example in Hollywood. The classics. Yeah. yeah. There's a name that most of you don't know. But if you asked people in the industry, particularly stunt people who are the most influential people in the stunt world, the first known huge star of stunt work was a, a stunt man named Hal Needham. Mm -hmm. And anybody in the stunt world would tell you. You, the stunt world is what it is because of the things that Hal Needham did. Uh, he worked a lot with Burt Reynolds as well. In fact, when I was a kid, I had a Hal Needham stunt set. I wish I still had that. But it had a breakaway table, a breakaway bar that he could fall through. Um, so I'm sure there's a ton of people in the in all of the industries that we still haven't even heard of. All right. Here's a question that's on Reddit. Most influential actor ever in Tamil cinema. And it specifically actor? says actor. Um, that's going to be a debate. So that's going to people going to have. A, that's like the most. Who's the mo, who's the best basketball player ever? You're going to have a fight over that. Um, might tell you it's Rajini, but um, or is it Kamal? It's got to be those two. Damal actor between MGR Rajini. I don't know what MGR is. Um, some people do have a VJ. 
in terms of the, the current VJ. Uh, he's been around for a good while. He's been around a long time. He's very popular. Very popular. I just, I'm not familiar with his, um, um, in terms of how he's changed it. I'm very aware of True. how popular He's very he popular and very influential. And at the same time, I always, you know, I think to myself, when you were still in your dad's testicles, Kamal and Roger DeConth were making, yeah, they were already stellar careers. And I bet he would he say would agree. them. I, of course. I would imagine. Um, but I'm sure uh, Superstar and well, Kamal and be, would also There's say, a lot of people right now screaming up and down for it. Yeah, he's just so young. But guys, what about Ani? That's true. But you can't say he's, he's just more getting influential started. Than, than, than I, I, there's no way he would ever say no. that I'm more influential than AR no. and, and you have It has to be somebody that's been around. I don't think Kamal would even say that. About what? I'm the most influential person. Of course not. He would say some act, oh, like classic actor, or you would say anybody directors. Or, anybody who cares about not being arrogant is not going to say I'm the best at anything. Um, unless, you know, you're a completely... Anyway. Because, um, I mean, if you're taking... I'm I'm talking about the totality of influencing the industry, right? In terms of how you've changed it, right? Sure, there's more popular actors maybe than Kamal, um, maybe. <laughs> um, uh, that's stuff for a hot debate, I right. guess. Right. Well, this past year, who are the two most popular directors right now as far as name recognition? It's going to be Barbenheimer. It's going to be Christopher Nolan and and yeah. Greta Gerwig. But n Steven Spielberg, yeah. Uh, is he the most influential director? Probably not. Of the of the I'm talking past, all, I'm talking all time. Oh, that's that's tough. He's definitely in the top five. He's he's one hundred percent in of the terms top of five. modern cinema. Probably the most influential. Yeah, uh, director the past thirty years of modern cinema. But it depends on what you're talking about as well, because Scorsese's earlier, in the conversation. Are you talking earlier? Alfred Hitchcock, Cecil B. DeMille, Cecil B. DeMille. You talking Chaplin even? Chaplin's got to be in the conversation. In terms of how much you change the industry. Yeah. Spielberg is definitely in the top five. Frank Capra. Yeah. Huge contributor to American cinema. You wouldn't have the modern blockbuster without Steven Spielberg. Or Lucas. But I, you'd give it more to Spielberg because yeah. Jaws was the first. The term blockbuster came because of Jaws. Yeah. So. Anyways. Anyway. You guys know way better than we do. Yeah. So you uh, hot, hot debate that down in the comment section below. And uh, let us know why we're idiots uh, for <laughs> not mentioning who <laughs> we've forgotten. Because uh, I'm sure there was at least 12 people. Uh, it reminds that, me of the, it reminds me of that line in Ratatouille when he says, "You could fill books with the amount of stuff Dad doesn't know, <laughs> and they have." Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Uh, anyways, let us know uh, why we're idiots down below. Josh!